Hello, good morning, everybody. How are you? I hope you are all doing well. I hope you are healthy and strong and patient. And I hope you enjoy today because today is beautiful outside. It's a little chilly. You might need a sweater in the beginning, but later it'll be nice. And uh, welcome to story time. So I was playing some music. I was dancing. It's good to dance. It's good for your heart. It's good for your hand it makes you feel good so make sure you dance actually that was a hint about the story we're doing today so let let me try that again okay let me So did you get the hint? Did you hear it? Kama, 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 chameleon. Yes, chameleons. We're doing stories about a chameleon today. I hope you like. Wait, what? You don't know what a chameleon is? <laughs> By the end of today, you're going to know so much about chameleons, really. So let's start. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the name of our story today is A Color of His Own by Leo Leone. And it's called A Color of His Own. It's published by Alfred A. Knopp in New York City. And it was copywritten in 1975. So parrots are, what, what color are parrots? Yes, they are green. And goldfish are, well, here they're red, but sometimes goldfish are yellow and sometimes they're orange. Elephants are, yes, they are gray. Pigs are pink. All animals have a color of their own, except for chameleons. What color is he right now? Yes, he's yellow. They change color wherever they go. On lemons, they're yellow. In the heather, they are purple. And on a tiger, they are striped like the tigers. One day, a chameleon who was sitting on a tiger's tail said to himself, If I remain on a leaf, I shall be green forever. And so I will have a color of my own. With this thought, he cheerfully climbed onto the green leaf. But in autumn, the leaf turned yellow, and so did the chameleon. Later, the leaf turned red, and the chameleon too turned red. And then the winter winds blew and the blew the leaf off the branch, and with it the chameleon. Oh, there he goes. He's falling off the leaf. The chameleon was black in the long winter night. But when spring came, he walked out into the green grass. And there he met another chameleon. He told his sad story. Won't we ever have a color of our own, he asked. 
I'm afraid not, said the other chameleon, who is older and wiser. But, he added, why don't we stay together? We will still change color wherever we go, but you and I will always be alike. And so they remained side by side. They were green together and purple and yellow. And they lived happily ever after. The end. So, that's our chameleon story. Did you like it? It was full of colors and full of the chameleons changing colors. But I figured maybe we should see a little more about that. Um, actually, here's a real honest to goodness chameleon and he's green. Oh, and look at this chameleon. He actually has horns on his head. And this chameleon is turning all sorts of wild colors. This chameleon's pretty big. Look, there's a hand underneath holding him up. So that's that's a pretty big size chameleon. And look at this chameleon. He's tiny, tiny, tiny. So, chameleons can be big, they can be tiny, 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 and they can be all sorts of colors. But I have one more surprise for you. Let's watch a chameleon actually changing colors, okay? Let's see. Look, there he is. He's kind of red and pink, right? Let's see, what color do you think he's going to change? Oh, oh, look, look, look. Oh, oh my gosh, he's green. All of a sudden, he's green. And look at his eyes. Imagine one eye is looking one way and another eye is looking another way. So he gets a really good picture of his surroundings. He can pretty much look behind himself. There he is looking, 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 looking. Oh, he's changing colors. What color is he? Yes, did you say yellow? There's the yellow chameleon. So that's, those are our chameleons for today. I hope you enjoyed them. And I hope you have some crayons, different color crayons. And whatever color you pick is perfect because that's the color a chameleon can be, right? Okay. Have a wonderful day. And I'll see you next time. Bye.